I like the Evercade Retro Handheld. I think it's a pretty cool device. I've been talking about it for a long time, looked at every single cartridge that has come out thus far, but I'm not one of those crazy fanboys. You're not gonna see my face on the thumbnail looking like I'm about to take a shit. I just like the thing. I'm not gonna marry it. I can't do things with this that I could with another human being. But I still like it. I'm just not crazy. Like, oh my God, there's so many fan communities that are just freaking nuts. Or at least they'll be like those outliers. A couple people who are just freaking insane. If you're hyped up over something, fine, I guess. But, you know, these two cartridges, to get back on point here, holy crap. 15 and 16. Uh, the last two was 13 and 14. They were both the Atari Lynx Collection 1 and 2. A couple of my absolute favorite cartridges. These two I forgot that I ordered. Why did I forget that I ordered them? Because I wasn't as excited. I don't know if I still am. I forgot that I had these coming. They showed up. Now we're going to open them up and test them out real quick. Because why the hell not? We got the Jalico Collection 1. 8-bit, 16-bit games. We got what? 10 of them on there? We got... Astyanax, I don't know, Astyanax, I don't know how the hell you say that. Base is loaded, I do remember really enjoying that game back in the day. Brawl Brothers, City Connection, Earth Defense Force. You know what, this one has some legit shit. Operation Logic Bomb, Rival Turf, Super Goal 2, Mission Factor, totally rad. Take a look at the manual in a second. Now we got the Pico Collection too, maybe it, I, I wasn't... Excited about this because this is like sports games, but I think there's a PlayStation game on here for the first time Which I think the worms one when that comes out it has yeah, okay We'll get into that when that one comes out, but this has 8-bit 16-bit 32-bit games 13 of them you got a little weird looking uh, Football soccer dude depending on you know where you are in the world whatever, you know, but it's a bunch of sports games I mean I'm not that excited about sports games. There's some sports games I really enjoy, but what do we got here? Beast Balls, Eliminator Boat Duel. That, that, that one's kind of fun. Football Madness, Full Throttle, Hoop, Shut Up and Jam, Shut Up and Jam 2, Power Football, Racing Fever, Soccer Kid, Summer Challenge, Top Racer. Okay, Top Racer's cool. Winter Challenge and World Trophy Soccer. So let's open this one up first, take a look at the... Uh, the manual real quick. I'm not gonna play every single game in this video. It's not too much of a review. It's just kind of a first impressions type of thing. I'm waiting for that vert. Oh shit, it came with stickers, dude. What am I gonna do with these dumb little kid with the freaking soccer kid? Retro forever. Okay, I can get behind that. I don't know about the stickers, but you know, some people, they, they you know, they get the Evercade logo tattooed to their butt cheeks. They might put this shit all over their car. I don't know. Oh my god. Uh, I, I've just seen some crazy shit and I've been getting like crazy messages and a lot of these fan bases just fucking nuts, dude. Oh my god. So it talks about Pico. I like Pico. They got some cool licenses, you know, stuff that they've uh, they've purchased and have the rights to. But the, the, the sports games, I just, I don't know. Eliminator Boat Duel might be alright. There we go. Top Racer 2, Winter Challenge. I like their little manuals, man. We got some manuals to take a look at, so that's cool. Shut up and jam. Full throttle. And they got all the, the carts listed down there. Oh yeah, that Indie Games one is uh, number 17. That's, that's the next one that's supposed to come out. And then they have a few more. We've been talking about them, but I, I'm waiting on that, that Evercade Versus, VS, whatever the hell that is. Here's the cart. Number 16, Pico Collection 2 in your face. Sports titles. We'll go ahead and um, we're we're I don't I don't really want to sit here and be like, look at the handheld. You know what? Actually, I'm looking at the viewfinder. I could actually do it this way, and it would be fine. But you know what? Let's plug this thing in. Hope for the best. Turn it on. We'll let that boot up because it does take a second. Blaze Entertainment. It's gonna pop up over there in a second here. Let's go ahead and get this Jalico collection opened up. Let's take a look at this because we got to prep this one too because we're gonna. We're gonna test a couple games on this one. But I, I do like, you know, it's like gotta have them all type of thing. Like these Evercade games, they're so freaking cheap and you get a case. I mean, I, I like cases, I, I, I really do. I mean, I, I like some. 
Like, I've been collecting Neo Geo Pocket Color games only in the case, other than maybe one or two games. But I, I love cases, so you know what? You got me sold on the case thing. Uh, I, I mean, that's cool. I'll buy these just for the fucking case. Oh, there's a Jalico collection. Nice cartridge. Oh, what did we get in here? No stickers? Come on, Evercade? I wanted stickers, man. What the frick are we doing here? Are we getting a poster? Am I gonna frame this shit? Probably not, but it is pretty dope. Game over, dude. Cool little poster. What's on the back? Oh, that's, you know what? I dig this. This is like, you know, old school stuff. I'm, I need to get me these carrying cases. You wanna know what I've been using for like everything, for my Neo Geo Pocket and my Evercade? These Club Nintendo pouches. I have like five or six of these. I try to buy them whenever I see them for around 10, 15 bucks because they're getting harder and harder to find. Uh, you know, especially because with the light color, you'll have people, it looks like they wiped it on their butt. So I try to find new ones for like 10, 15. If you have these, like the Club Nintendo, the, the red one or the blue one, or you have the Legend of Zelda one, and you want to sell them for like under 20 bucks, hit me up, man. I'll buy every single one of them you got, as long as they're not bootlegs. But I use, I use those for everything, but I, I might have to... Might have to switch over to that damn case, that Evercade carry case. Might have to try to get me one of those. Oh, there we go. There's the worms cart. Looking forward to that one. There we go. All right, what do we got here? We got Beast Ball. Let's let's zoom up, man. Like, quit playing games. Well, I mean, isn't that what we're here for? To play to play a game real quick. Let's just you know, I don't want to dwell on this sports one, but I do want to see what everything looks like here. So there we go, scroll through. Football mat, that's the PlayStation game, isn't it? We'll check that out in a second. Barkley shut up and jam. Soccer kid, that's not even a sports game. The hell? I've been deceived. I thought that was a sports game, it's a platformer. The hell? <laughs> Top Racer's cool game. All right, let's, let's get back over here. You know what? Let me see what this uh, football madness looks like. Let, let's see. This is PlayStation, right? They got a loading screen for it? Hmm. Load, dude. Let's see what this looks like. I'm not going to I'm not going to stay in this forever. Responsive with my 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 D-pad pressing. Let's see how this this looks. If we got like frame skipping, if it's smooth, Let's see. Kick, kick off. Oh, did I just kick him in the nuts? All right, that's kind of cool. This this Evercade can handle this stuff. Oh, get out of here. I don't know what the buttons are, but you know, hey, that that's kind of that's kind of dope. This thing, you know, this game's running pretty good. Oh, he was doing an ultimate kick action there. Damn, they got like special moves. All right, let's get out of that. So we could do load states, save states. What are in the settings? Just, you know, aspect ratio stuff. It seems like they had the uh, PlayStation buttons set up properly, so I'm not tripping on that. Let me see that, that soccer kid real quick. What the hell is this, dude? <laughs> I thought this was an actual soccer game. Oh my God, Ocean Software, but it's now owned by Pico. Come on, why, why is it taking so long? Right, this game sucks with just how long it takes to get into it. Kickoff. Hey, give me my ball back, dude. Do I have to keep the ball with me? Oh shit. All right, this is, this is interesting. We got snacks in the uh, sewer system here. Okay, you know what? I'm, I'm done with this cart for now. This is interesting though. I do want to play this more, but I want to check out that Jalico, Yalico collection. Did we look at the manual for the Jalico collection? No, we didn't. Let me put the uh, cart in there and boot it up and then we'll look at the manual real quick. I don't, I don't remember if we looked at the manual. Did I not look at the manual? Can you tell me live? Oh wait, you can't. It's okay, I'll edit this out if we already looked at the manual, but I don't think we did. Base is loaded, love that game back in the day. Ask the whatever. Okay, there's some cool shit on here. 
Brawl Brothers? Crash, crash, back, crash, spooch all over your... What? Interesting. Earth Defense Force, can't go wrong. Love me some Earth Defense Force. City Connection, I don't know if I care about that one. Rival Turf, that's cool. You know what they need to get is an S&K collection. Do the Neo Geo Pocket Collection, Evercade. I'll be a crazy fanboy and, and make thumbnails that look like I'm shitting my pants. If you guys can get the uh, Neo Geo Pocket Color Collection on your system, that would be dope. I'll, I'll do it. Swear. Okay, let's play this real quick. Hope, hopefully the... Uh, okay, see, that loads up right away. What are the settings? Screen ratio, that's it. Okay. I've always seen this game. I don't remember ever fucking playing it. Okay. I think this was like one of those games you always saw at the rental store and nobody ever rented it. Like it was it was that one game that was always available. But it seems pretty dope though. I ain't gonna lie. You got Eye of the Beholder thingy flying around at you. And I just I just died. Damn it. That's cool, that's cool. Let's switch to a different game though. Okay, so the, like that PlayStation game had the load for a second. These games just are instant. Not that much info, information going on. All right, this is cool, this is cool. Very, very nice. Operation Logic Bomb, that looks kind of cool. You got totally rad. Back to ass. There we go. A little top down uh, shooter, operation, whatever it was called. That's kind of cool. So, I mean. My excitement for the um, the Jalico collection kind of increased. There's some cool stuff on here. The Pico collection too. I mean, if I didn't have to have them all, I probably would have passed on this. But I do want to check out that soccer kit a little bit more. But really cool. I mean, these are available on Amazon, tons of other places. $20 a cartridge if you're into this kind of thing. Yes, I know you can emulate all these games on your mom's vibrator that she got from Adam and Eve. Isn't that a place? We're not sponsored at all. The, the retro gaming vibrator, we're not sponsored, but come on now. If that existed, I would have to promote it. Why not? But you know, if you're into this and you're into these uh, cartridges to collect, why the hell not? Appreciate you guys. Peace out. Bye-bye. Big ass thumb button in your face. And boom. Bye.